Steve Sacramento here again, and today I am going on my second, what I'm calling my second official photo hike. And today I am on Mare Island, which is part of Vallejo, California. It used to be a naval shipyard since the 1850s. Uh, there was, I forget how many ships made here um, it's in the hundreds for sure and now it is a, basically an abandoned naval shipyard back in the 1990s and it's kind of a hodgepodge of different things now there's some businesses here there's a golf course there are new homes that are already built and people are living in them here there are more new homes being built um, you can drive by places where there's a street, where there's lots, and you can buy one of them and build your house. Uh, I stopped here to, as far as I can go on this street. I'll put the street up on the screen. I don't know what it is on top of my head. And there's a little parking lot here. That's building A167, and this is building A280. So if you're wanting to come on this hike and see the things I'm going to see today, if you see those buildings in the parking lot, that's where you start. And this is open from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. I think every day. I'm not sure. I'll have to check on that. But let's get started. It's my first official hike. And what I'm doing on these hikes or going to do on these hikes is pick my favorite five photos or images out of all the ones I take. And I will post those on Instagram so you can see them after I edit them, if they need it. So, without any further ado, let's get hiking. Photo hiking. Be back later. Well, as you can see, there is a cemetery on the island. And some of those date back to the 1800s. There were several that I saw that were from the 1920s also. So there are some very old ones there. So just so you know, there are trash cans in different places along the trail here, so if you have something to dispose of, put it in the trash can, not on the trail. And I'm just walking up to the spirit ship yet, and right here, along the side of the trail, is a nice little bench in the shade of a tree. And, like many places on the island, there's another abandoned building. Oh, let me show you real quick here. There's an old pipe in the ground here. I'm going to guess that's probably about five or six inches diameter, probably a water pipe or something. I always wonder who was it that laid though and when did he lay it and all that kind of stuff. Looks like a something 21 building. Not very big, but there's a little firewood in there. Yep, and some wood pallets. Huh. Could make that into a little shop, but not here. And right over here, seems kind of interesting. They have a little dam I'm walking on. And it collects the water from around the hillside here. And there's some sort of a brick water outlet I'm guessing. Hey I just met someone along the trail here that told me some very interesting information. Uh, he said he is the executive director of one of the local historical societies of the area and this reservoir uh, was used for many many years to feed water into the actual shipyard and even after the island was decommissioned as a naval shipyard, this reservoir would stay full even when there wasn't any rain. Well, they drained it one time and found out that the city water was keeping it full. So they had to shut it off so they didn't have water going here anymore. Well, as you can see, I made it up here. 
I'll get some pictures. It's kind of windy. Not sure how you could, how good you can hear me, but I'll show you some of the views from up here and see what kind of pictures I can get of the spirit ship with some of the other things around here, like the Kirkinas Bridge and whatnot. Try to get myself in one too, so I can prove I was here. something interesting here. The, I believe this is the highest point of the island. Over here is the actual naval shipyard, or was where the shipyard was. And there is South Vallejo. Here is the Carquinez Bridge. And this is the Napa River, or Mare Island Strait. Over there is San Pablo Bay, and over there is quite a marine layer coming in right now. But here is something interesting. Let me show it to you. Right there. Right there. I'll show you a picture of it right now. It's a survey marker. The date has a date of 1852 on it. Right here. SCNG Survey Station, Mare Island Southeast, established in 1852. 1852! Now I realize for Europe that's not very old, but for here that's old. I just thought I'd share that with you. Okay, let's try this again. I recorded, but it didn't record it. So, oh well. So, I'm here at the edge of the golf course. Right here is one of the golf tees. It's a bench and a little trash bin. And guess what this is? For you golfer, golfers, you'll know exactly what it is. I've golfed before, but I'm not a golfer. But I have used one before. You put your ball in the bottom hole, the, the hole there. And you go like this. And you wash your ball. <laughs> wash all your balls right here. Well, not here because it's empty and there's no water in it, but at one day you could wash all your balls here. <laughs> Hello. Well, I've been walking around the edge of the golf course and there was one storage place up here. I'll show you when I'm on the way back where I was going to walk in and see a, there's an open door and see if it's like a big storage underground area. But, there's a rattlesnake right next to the stairs, and I don't want to disturb him, so, or her, so, I'm not going to. I don't need a rattlesnake bite. Nope, I'm not going to go there. But, there is a nice view here. This is overlooking, I believe this is San Pablo Bay. It's a marine lair still there. A lot of old buildings and kind of a marshy area this is the edge of the golf course right here you can see it hasn't been used for quite a while because it's so overgrown with weeds now but a lot of old buildings down there I think at some point they're probably when they get the rest of the island developed they're probably going to go over to this side of it and one day in the future, I'll bet you, there's going to be brand new homes here overlooking the bay. And these old buildings may or may not be here then. We will see. So here's one of the storage places where you can back a truck up to. And there's a door open on the left there. And a little vent a ways back that way. And unload or load all your missiles or ammunition or who knows what they stored in there. I don't know. But right over here by that step, that's where there's a rattlesnake, so I'm not going in there. Maybe another day, but not today. 
So, I walked up the path here. There's the storage place that had the rattlesnake uh, by the steps. Over there's the naval shipyard, and that's Highway 37 bridge over there. And right here is the green for hole three on the golf course. And then up there, somewhere you can't see it from here, over the hill, is the tee off for hole number four. Sometimes I am very blessed, or lucky, or just in the right place at the right time. <laughs> I was just taking a picture here and thinking, probably not many people get a picture from this side of the spirit ship. And then this happened. Yep, somebody walking their dog, so you can see there's a path there. <laughs> I like my blessings. <laughs> well, I'm back to the parking lot. I think I got some really good shots today. Quite a variety. I'll put my favorite five on Instagram and put the link below or the name below where you can find them. Uh, I think it's time for a beer. I'm gonna go to the Mare Island Brewing Company, get a beer. Hope you enjoyed these shots. This was photo hike number two from Mare Island. I don't know where photo hike number three is gonna be, but it'll probably be in a week or two, and then you can see. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. Bye.